those crazy cats out there, and how are we doing tonight? <laughs> um, sorry I la uh, missed last week. I've been having some physical and emotional problems, but we're all good now. And uh, we were going to have an episode of Our Life the Show last Friday, but we had some camera difficulties, so sorry we've been missing in action, I guess. Well, without further ado, I'm going to describe what we're going to do today. It's a little bit different. Not a It's kind of like a shopping video, but it's more like a haul and showing off basically some of my wardrobe. And the store of choice is Hot Topic. Most of you know that Hot Topic is a favorite of mine. If you look at my older video for fall and Halloween fashion, most of it was Hot Topic. Hot Topic gets a lot of hate, I think. Back in the day, if you liked new metal or just punk, pop, and everything, you'd have those collars with the spikes and, like, they call it the hot gothic, as my husband calls it. But I remember being in eighth grade, going to one, and my first shirts were... My first band shirts, I should say, was Slipknot and Guns N' Roses with, like, the cross and skulls. I can't remember what CD it is. I think it's something of destruction. I'm sorry. Anyway, ever since then, like, every year I would go there and get, like, one or two shirts for school and everything. And their fashion and everything has grown over the years. It's just kind of wild to see. Like, their physical stores nowadays are kind of lackluster, but their online store is huge. Like... There's things for anime, there's things for, like, Disney, Studio Ghibli, um, games and everything. Like, if you, like, anime especially, go there. They have, like, a lot of, ha uh, my friend's favorite is Haiku, uh, Hero Academia. They have some Black Butler. I think sometimes they had JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, but they have a lot. Like, new and, like, some old. Like, Inuyasha is a big one, too. Anyway, this is just basically showing my haul from the years at Hot Topic and um, just like my real style, I guess. Gothic, uh, spooky, girly too. But without further ado, I'm gonna show off my accessories first. <laughs> well, this isn't really an accessory, but this is like a bralette slash sports bra kind of thing. On the tag, it says not normal because who wants to be normal? It has, like, an open back, kind of, and, like, an open, like, keyhole or the chest. It's kind of comfortable. I have some boys' Deadpool box of briefs. And if you've seen my Halloween one, you've seen this belt. I've always wanted a studded belt, and I got a Halloween one. One of many hats. My Totoro hat. With the little floppy ears over here. Another uh, slouch beanie, I guess you'd call it. Put it on real quick, I guess. And some hair headbands, that's what I'm trying to say. This one is plaid with a bow. This one's like a weird looking half black, half skull one. I have multiple hair bows. I'll show off two at a time. Again, skull, black and white stripe, kind of like Beetlejuice. This big black and white polka dot one. Uh, two metallic ones, one purple, one like turquoise blue. And another striped one, and it's blue and white. It's kind of cool because they have the little clip, and they have like a pin here so you can like use it as a bow tie. It's kind of cool. Another hand clip are my skull hands. And my last hat. Gotta have the curbs. <laughs> and I'm gonna show off a few items of clothing right now anyway. Up first, since we're keeping with the curvy theme, is my Link curvy shirt. This is relatively new. I just got it a couple weeks ago. It's a suspender skirt that has skulls on it and also has pockets because pockets are very important, ladies. And these uh, kind of like sweatpants, pajama pants with link shield on it. Okay, without further ado, we'll do our mini fashion show. This is also from Hot Topic. I forgot to mention it when I was sitting over there. But it's got skull and roses on it. 
and it's like a tunic style and it kind of ripped right here but it has like a keyhole back this is like a trench coat dress it is technically uh doctor who with a little plaid in there um i don't really know doctor who much but i just love the trench coat and you can't really tell that's doctor who it's got pockets This is a suspender skirt. I got it a long time ago, but yeah, just black and red. And this one is kind of a repeat from the Halloween fall one. It has pockets. And the skull print. Let's see if I can. I don't even know if that's coming out. Here's a plaid, like, skirt tail also has pockets. This is one of my favorite ones. It's Totoro Sleeping. It's also a suspender skirt. Here's a close-up of that. This one I showed in the Halloween one. It is a Gryffindor Harry Potter skirt. I took a test. I'm actually Hufflepuff. And this one is just like a simple frilly plaid one. It's a little short on me. I have to wear it with uh, leggings, so I'm not going to be wearing it. Boo. These are my yellow plaid pants. Again, if you want to see me wearing them, I'm pretty sure I have them in the Halloween fall one. And I have these. They are not pajama pants, even though they kind of look like it. Um, and they're kind of really soft, but they have pockets, button and zipper. Here is another skirt tail. And apparently, guys love it because every time I wear this, I get compliments. Some from girls and some from creepy guys. I'm married, people. <laughs> Here is another Tortoro dress with some flowers, and he's blowing on his little, I'm just going to call it a rock and rainer. <laughs> cold shoulder. And here is kind of like a matching shawl, big old Totoro on the back, and on the front is a little guy. And here is a, another Totoro dress. This one is my favorite. It even has little bows in the back. This is my Wind Waker dress, and it's like window pane. And two other dresses that I did wear during my Halloween one. Oops, my bad. My skull one. And my pumpkin one. Here is a blue sugar skull dress. Kind of like a unique back. <laughs> um, and here is my skull dress that I also wore in the Halloween one. And two shirts, pick and roll, we bear bears, me, my son and I's favorite. And a touch row holding an umbrella. All right, obviously I know this doesn't match, but I didn't want to. This it's not really. It's like a dress shirt. Anyway, here are my Zelda pants and my cold shoulder skull shirt dress thing. And we have Full Metal Brotherhood pants. These are actually still in stock online. And my shirt. I'll find a little kitty. And over here. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do a little lightning round. And here, first up is cardigans. Well, this is like a jean jacket that's camo. Oh, crap. <laughs> This one is skulls. It's like inside, outside kind of thing. This one has skulls on the elbows. Just a simple red black stripe. T-shirts. Yay tacos, Deadpool. Zelda shield and sword. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Another Zelda. I think this one's a link to the past. Yes. The Beatles. Seal and uh, Sebastian. Black like Butler. Grill. Uh, Sweet dreams are made of this. Marilyn Manson. Controversial right now. And, uh, what the hell does this one say? Marilyn Manson. Are you the rabbit? Skull skirt. And this is like a dress tunic thing. Sucks because it was filled with glitter. Tried putting Mod Podge on it and now it's sticky. Favorite shirt and I can barely wear it. 
All right, this is a maxi skull skirt. I need to like take it to a seamstress to like take it in a little bit, it's a little big, and it's very long, but it has pockets. And this is a boy, uh, they call it a boyfriend's t-shirt. That's why it's kind of like cut weird. It's kind of punk rock. It's comfortable. Eh. All right, here's my pajamas. Well, I got the shirt first and then we got the pants later, but we bear bears. It matches. <laughs> We're gonna do another speed run of shirts. This one is Skull and Roses, and it's a cold shoulder and kind of like a zigzag back. <laughs> it's Pano and Ham. This one is just a simple black V neck with a panda on it. Uh, <laughs> this is kind of like a kind of like a crop top, not too much, and it has music notes on it. This one is kind of off the shoulder striped shirt with an anchor on the side. Another pair of pajama pants. I'm simply one hell of a butler. This again is a Doctor Who shirt. I don't get it. It's just probably because of 13 doctors. Rainbow. This one is <clears throat> another, it's kind of like a crop top, but it's more like a shirt with a shamrock on it. The number 13 and my skull and roses kind of like pin up 50 style dress well i hope you all enjoyed that and uh got you some ideas to buy some things i forgot to show a couple things my bad uh one thing is this mask that i got last year it has skulls and i think butterfly no leaves <laughs> and one of my favorite things is my backpack of link on it it did break it broke in japan i don't know where the piece went because i just had like a snap right here <laughs> like i said hope you enjoyed i hope you guys look at some hot topic stuff and get good ideas please like comment and subscribe and see you next time on sonya stuff <laughs>